Hello and welcome wherever you happen to be watching around the world. Our action today comes from this intimate venue, the Bentana Arena in Paderborn. My name is Derek Ray, excited to be bringing you match commentary. And alongside me, my broadcasting partner, Stuart Robson. And with the atmosphere really building up nicely, we should be in for a terrific contest. It's Estse Paderborn and they take on Magdeburg. Thanks, Derek. Well, both managers will be reminding their players of starting the game quickly, hitting the opposition back, playing the ball forward and regaining possession as quickly as possible. Hopefully, we get a really good game here. This is the lineup for the home team. Well, the wide midfield players and the fullbacks need to have a good understanding here. If the midfield players tuck in, then the fullbacks need to get forward into the space they vacate, just to give them some attacking width. And introducing the visitors lineup today. Well, the wingers will be key here. They have to choose the right time to give width and the right time to come infield to support the centre forward. If they can do that, they're a potent front three. No doubt about that. And they kick off here. Plate. Crisp tackling. Barish Attic. Top class defending. No mistake by the keeper. Can they forge ahead? Well, they would have done had it not been for the keeper. Well, they should be ahead now. Yes, it was a good save, Derek, but he should score from there. And over comes the corner. Well, he wasn't messing around with the clearance. Marco Stiepermann. Schuster. Sabini. Well, just couldn't keep the ball. It's opening up for them. Philip Clement. And back with Hoot. Marco Stiepermann. Muslia. Can they find a gap in the defence? Well, then the one that fails to hit its target. Well, not a great challenge. Free kick here. Well, that could be the final warning. Well, he needs to be careful now. Next foul, and it's a card. to keep it but couldn't it's a weighted pass and the keeper has possession of it a 
And Müller with it. Platter. Muslia. Still passing it around with authority. Playing with purpose and control. Splendid defending, and it needed to be. Müller with it. That's a good-looking ball. A chance to whip it in. Well, space if he goes inside. Flinging himself at it, the keeper. And there's the delivery. And up for grabs off the keeper. Well, they survived the attack. Well, as you can see, the hosts have had most of the ball. But unless they find some inspiration from somewhere, I'm not sure where the winner will come from. They certainly need to up the tempo. Intelligent threaded pass here. Not away completely. Oh, I think he'll be kicking himself. Ruled offside. Well, his instinct should have told him he was offside there. He has to be more alert in the box. Committed challenge. So the whistle then. We're at the halfway stage in this match. Plenty to consider based on what we've seen so far as the second half begins. Philip Clement. He got a good palm on it. Well, you have to think they're going to take the lead at some point because they're really looking dangerous at the moment. Read it well defensively. This might be ideal for the counter. An attack full of promise. Chance to cross. And a goal kick is the outcome. Now they're going to alter things. Here's the substitution. Quite and strongly to win the ball. Philip Clement and unable to keep possession fruitful looking attack it might be on for them and Barish Attic with it firing it towards goal 
and just over the bar, albeit narrowly. the perfect position to read it Muslia on the ball Clement setting off perhaps a little bit too much here just knocking it around looking to carve out a chance well good technique in terms of how he struck it Well, I must say he acquitted himself well under pressure. Florian Kart. Looking confident with the ball at his feet. And that's an important intervention. What a shocking pass, really. This looks promising. And a timely intervention. Schuster well, I couldn't quite find his teammate and the search goes on for a winner time is tight and the cross into the middle Time is running out to get this winner, but the fans certainly believe it's coming. Just listen to the noise. What a fantastic finish we could have here. Marco Stiepermann. There will be one minute added on at the end. Philip Clement. Will it happen for them? And now passing it through. Great save to keep it even. Well, it's a fantastic stop and so important at this stage of the game. And time for the change now. Playing it in. But he took care of it defensively. And there's the whistle. They can't be separated after 90 minutes.